welcome back everybody um bad news lettuce died uh, the cold was way too much for it even in the greenhouses so we're gonna have to get some more seeds in there uh, it's on both of them we're gonna have to get more seeds and fertilizer in there at some point get them back up and rate operating uh, I'm gonna be honest I maybe should have shut the windows <laughs> it's an oversight um, anyway we have some busy work ahead of us today because the prices for corn and sunflower have just shot through the roof there's a massive amount of demand for them um, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be completely honest I believe it's due to the uh, severe weather we've had recently the farmers market has been screaming for it so they are literally taking all the corn we have so we're going to get that loaded in now there we are that's the last of our corn the prices are super high makes a change for us get some good money for them we've still got our uh, snow tires on so let's get cracking head on down to the farmers market and get this sold and try and work out where the roadway is Hopefully this uh, snow will, wee, will clear up soon. Here we are approaching the farmer's market. Let's get it in, get it sold, get it done and dusted. Come on, swing in nice and wide. And a lot of sunflower seeds that can be sold as well. The prices are astronomical. You'll see the grain shoot up. I think we normally get about 15 grand for 18,000 litres. And you'll see how much we'll get for this one. How long this little up, up, upturn in fortune will last, who knows. There you go, 17 grand for 3,000 less litres. Not bad, not bad at all. So we're going to quickly get all these do done as quick as we can. That's lovely and warm in this cab. <laughs> it's not so much outside, but in here it's absolutely lovely. There we go. That's all top top. That's the last. <clears throat> that's the last load. Last load to be delivered, uh, it's sunflower, and the best price still is very high, but it's starting to drop at the farmer's market. So we're going to get over there as quick as we can. Hopefully it don't drop anymore, because it's fantastic in price. Uh, we we'll get it done as quick as we can and get it sold. Oh, we hello. We're losing a little traction at the moment. It's not the tyres on the truck, it's the... Uh, it's the weight we're towing. The trailer likes to swing round in this snow. Um, when it does, it half calls a little tail whip. Right, we'll get it done, and we'll see you soon. Uh, it's nice that they've been able to maintain the roadways, even through all the storm that we've had. Uh, come on, Mr. Car, out the way. Alright, this is the last of it, so good price we should be getting all there now it's up to about 1400 per thousand you can't really argue with that all right go on go on hit the 200 hit the 200 beautiful and it keeps going 42,000 oh sunflower seeds are awesome <laughs> so there we have it we have over 200 grand haven't I been so good since that sugar beet harvest? Alright. Uh, we're going to pop in over at the store. Have a word with uh, Dylan. Or maybe Daryl's in. See what's happening over there. Maybe you can pick up something nice second hand. Have a look in the marketplace while we're here. Still after a header for that combine. Although I don't particularly like taking the trader around town with me. Oh, 
Uh, I'll have to be a bit courteous and not park in his car park. Um, I'm not going to like that. I'll just pull over in this nice big gap here. At least that way we can fit. Alright. Alright, well I'll pop in, have a little chin wag, and uh, we'll see you in a mo. Well, that was a quick and short trip. They've got nothing but a massive harvester, which we can't afford. Um, in the second-hand market for today. There's no news of any upcoming auctions. Nothing. Um, I, I'll be honest, Dylan did look a little um, glum. Uh, who knows why that is. I'm sure we'll find out eventually. Oh, there's traction there. Again, that's the trailer, not me. That's what I'm going to tell everyone. No cut. Whoa, hello. See, that's why you stop. <laughs> Alright. So we'll head home and sort out the lettuce. I oh, will see you in a minute. Everyone going to. You get on the right side of the road. Right, there we go. Yeah, so we're back here at the farm. Uh, we've got to get the trailer popped away. Keeping it in here for now. It makes sense. Keeps it out of the uh, weather. And we've got to crack on with other jobs. So, let's get it in. Hello, everyone. It hasn't been more than about five minutes since you last seen us. Look at the fish. We are in the pond. That's all right. We just broke up the ice so the fish can get air. There we go. All put away there. Uh, yeah, we've got to get some seed and fertilizer into those. Uh, we're going to swing the truck on home. Go grab a tractor. Hopefully, cold start will be all right on it. I hope so, because I haven't got any ether. Alright. Oh, it's cold. Oh, let's close that up. Uh, we're going to want this one, I think. <sighs> okay. That was a bit jittery. Give it a minute after initial start up. I should really check them all while I'm here. Oh, wow. Uh, <laughs> we caught me. Look at that. Straight away. No problem. Alright. We'll leave those to warm up. Now the engine's been ticking over a bit. I'll let that oil flow through. Um, let's go to the other shed. Make sure everything's alright over there. Fuel's looking good. Still got nearly 2,000. That's completely frozen solid. <laughs> How are we doing in here? Everything looks alright in here. Could probably use that to do the fertiliser and that, but... Yeah... Uh, that could prove painless, painful. All well, that would mean I'll get to use a McCormick for this job. Oh, that's cold. I think we're going to use that as well because that John Deere sounded a bit rough in this weather. And we're not even into the snow yet. There we go.
in front of Thatcher as well. This should be a lot easier. Yeah, just making sure I had got one on there. Let's push this open. Yeah, I'm gonna just get this attaching it out of the way. Then we can get to that little trailer and make things a little easier. Just there we do. Open up the side door and go in that way for the other one. That's it. Open up. Back a bit more. There we go. See? See? No problem. Uh, question is, have I got enough seed in that to do this? Didn't check that. I should have checked it, really. Uh, let's find out. Uh, we've got 5,000, that's it. Uh, let's hope it doesn't take it all. Got two of them, so... I've got to try and stop it at about 2,500. Wrong weight. Yeah, uh, one took a lot more than 2,500. So um, we're going to need a lot more seed. That's all the seed gone. So I'm not really worried about doing the fertilizer just yet i just pull this here and i'm going to order some more seed um and, f and probably fertilizer to about nine grand's worth in total um we'll order some of that I'll leave that out and um, we'll go get a cup of tea oh it's a brisk morning i might, might treat myself to a nice coffee i've got a cappuccino in there i think or maybe I've got a latte sachet. Uh, we'll have something and a bit of toast. And oh look, I left my door open this morning. Oh. So yeah, oh look, I've got my croissants still. I forgot about them. So yeah, I'm going to have a spot of breakfast and a coffee. Um, we'll order those. Fil so we'll order a little bit of fertiliser and a load of seed. Um, and once that's been and gone, and they've dumped that in the bins for us, we'll... Uh, We'll empty the bins. So I'll see you shortly. Ah, welcome back. Uh, right, let's get cracking, shall we? Um, yeah, everything's back. Oh, everything's back. Everything's done. Uh, they filled them up. I ordered another 5,000 of seed. I know I'm going to use a bit more again now, but I tried to round it to as close to 200,000 uh, 200, as I could. Rather than having to dip down. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, we got that done. Um, I think we found out why Dylan's, um, Dylan and Daryl may have the ump, or not not the ump, but the, why they're down in the blues. Uh, I spoke to Frank a little while a little while ago. He gave us a phone call, and um, it turns out uh, obviously we need we need to get confirmation from the guys. But um, Th Frank is pretty much under the belief that the uh, the company, um, the company Cleveland Motors that runs the uh, shop, etc., um, they're doing a change up of management teams. So uh, yeah, Dylan and Daryl are going to be moved on to a new area and a new manager come in, uh, which is kind of a shame because you know we we got we got on really well with them. Um, and I think I think they pretty much love the area as well. Um, from what I gather, they've been here about ten years. So, but maybe maybe we can maybe we could chat have a chat with them over the next couple of days. I think they got they must have some time to before they they have to get out. If that makes sense. Um, I can't imagine they're leaving any time soon, as uh, surely they would have said something. Uh, you just don't know with some people, I suppose. Oh, well, 
That's it, we took that back in the grate. And now we're going to fill up with some fertiliser. Not sure if we're going to need quite as much. But we'll empty it. I think I've got, I should have just over 5,000 fertiliser in there now with the extra 2,000 I ordered. Ah, 6,000, there we go. So we had a little bit more in there originally than I thought I did. Uh, Fertiliser is quite key to us. It, well, it runs off greenhouses, obviously. Um, but more importantly, it helps with uh, fertilisation contracts, which is quite we're quite keen on those because they did. That's yeah, well, that's kind of how we got started over it, doing the odd fertiliser, and it saved our backsides when that mobster need what well, wanted money. Let's see if we can get through here. And just back it up. Actually used a lot more fertiliser than I thought it would. Worryingly how much it took. Yeah, left with only 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 seventeen hundred. Oh, I'm gonna have to order more fertiliser. I think I'll do it straight away though. Uh, this is just literally a day of tidying up the farm by the looks of it. I mean, I'd like to get in the fields, but I don't think this snow's going to dissipate. It's very cold still. It's warmed up a little bit. Don't get me wrong, it has. Just not as much as I really wanted it to. Uh, I'm going a long way around here, but there is method to the madness. Gotta get this put back in the right way. Uh, that's too much of an angle. Probably too little of an angle. Or not enough. Oh, yeah, not enough. Tires catching. There we go. Perfection. Ish. Ish. Alright, let's get this back in. Big old planter. There we go. It ain't gonna be perfect. Alright. Got it locked up. There we go. Let's get the McCormick. There we go. I tell you what, the heater in this is works better than the truck. It's fantastic. I'm loving the heated seats and the back support. It really does keep you toasty. Uh can see that the sheep haven't eaten all their hay yet. Producing plenty of bales of uh, wool there though. That's good. We'd like to see that. Right, everything looks good on the farm now. We've got the lettuce back going. Right, let's pull this in. Normally I'd reverse it in but we're just going to pull it in. Alright. Let's just get this started again. Oh, it sounds better now. It's just about getting that oil flowing through. There we go. Perfect. It's working again nicely. So yeah, just quick warm up. Let that oil circulate. I'm going to have to remember that. There we go. That's a trusty old John Deere, that one. Top notch little machine. Uh, this McCormick X Drive is absolutely fantastic. Um, not sure it's where it's from. Um, don't often see these about, but uh, really enjoy it. All right, 
Better get everything closed away. That's that done. Hey, I don't think I gave you a little, well, I don't think you've seen the garden yet, have you? So obviously where the old garden was at the back, we've just got a little offshoot garden here. Um, we're entertaining the summer. How the snow has peppered that. So that sort of shows you how the blizzard was blowing through. It's peppered chairs on both sides and thick on the table. Yet didn't really cover the sandbox. Huh. But yeah, this is a little entertainment garden. But there we go. Let's get inside. It's warmer in here. Whoa. Not much warmer. <laughs> I've had no heating on. Uh, I'm going to wash my hands up and that in a minute. Right, so yeah. Um, it's an easy day today on Second Chance Farm. Uh, let's hope this new season ahead of us is a prosperous one. Um we we started off well. I've still got the tillage to do, get these fields prepped and rolled and everything else, whatever we can do to them to get them prepped and then planted. But yes, looking forward to another year here, as long as everything goes according to plan. We've got one sticky situation, that is the land dispute, which we are losing badly. Uh, but hopefully that's going to be resolved soon. We have a court case, a court case, a court date at the end of February. And we're hoping that we can be home and dry after that. So, until next time, I've been Matty G. And I'm going to sit down on this lovely, comfortable leather chair. Uh, I'm going to watch a bit of Stargate SG-1. Which starts at 1pm. So I'll back kill. Uh, Armors Weekly. Well, until next time. Have a good one.